nerd soul. Woo! Ha ha! Late, okay, at one, you so holding it down, bringing that street geek and nerd soul. What is up, my people, today? Oh, yeah, coming with another wonderful episode of Nerd Soul Gaming. Today, we are debuting. That's right. Uh, some good old Power Rangers Battle for the Grid on the channel. Um, this is a game that my sensei, Open Mind, said was like, yo, man, I think you'll like it. It's a fun game. It's addictive. It's fun to play. Um, he picked it up. I don't know, maybe a couple months ago. I don't know what he picked it up. Whatever he picked it up. Um, he's He's been playing. I've seen a couple of his videos. And I was like, you know what? I haven't been into the actual show Power Rangers in years. But let me give it a shot. So I've had the game for two days now. And I'm going to I'm gonna run through these ranked matches. Give you my impressions of the game. And also talk about, you know, like how I get down in general. So um, if you ever want to get up and play, I am on here as Nerd Soul. I am not hard to find. But um, as you as you can see, the uh, if you've never seen this game, you know, of course, you're playing as Power Rangers characters throughout the um, like throughout the, the continuity of Power Rangers. And the game, um, what was uh, was it? Uh, Open Mind was telling me like the game is very simple and it the the setup for the game is kind of simple it's a team based game you get three players um, and you know you get you know you get to battle it out and you get to actually tag in people tag people out um, which is something uh, you know as someone who's played like you know MVC games or even now uh, Dragon Ball Fighters or um, you know what I'm saying, brawlers of that nature. I'm used to having kind of like teams and stuff. So it is fun to have people to tag in and tag out. But the, the way the dynamics of this game play out, it is, you have to be very strategic in how you call your, um, in how you call your assists because you don't get to choose, at least that I see, you don't get to choose the assist that your character uses. So essentially you know what you're doing is just like taking the preset assist and in a lot of cases you can get happy birthday about this piece and you don't want you don't want that um also i do like the i do like the idea of being able to like bring in a megazord i still don't fully understand how that works um as you can see this character left because i was whooping them so they left uh, connection lost <laughs> so they just left um uh once again oh i'm playing a i'm playing a um team of daishi uh rj and um forget other dude from spd but uh basically you know what i'm saying that's that's my squad for right now those are the characters that i'm into um that you know since i haven't watched power rangers in so long it's just characters that look cool <laughs> when I was scrolling past, and I knew I didn't want to be like the Red Ranger or the Green Ranger or something like, or the white, like something that I've already been, or I mean, s some people that I already knew. I wanted to try some new people, and then of course, like you know, um, RJ's list looks cool. I wish he had some more colorways to him. That's something. In getting to this game, I'll talk about a little more. Um, but since I've had this game for a total of two days and played it for a total of like uh, maybe three hours now. Um, as you can see, my results are not the greatest. I mean, I'm kind of doing okay, I guess you could say. But, um, you know, I'm just kind of like applying general fighting game knowledge to it and winging it, if you will. <laughs> um, so, uh, as far as, as far as the looks, the looks are okay. Um, it's built on Unity. So, it's not a ugly game. It's just weird things that are it's weird it's like it's like something that's it's like small little bells and whistles that are missing for what i would consider to be like what should be a triple a title you know what i'm saying and what i mean by that is like power rangers is not a small property it's a, it's a pretty large property i mean a lot of people know about the power rangers and if you were speaking about as far as popularity i'd be like you know power rangers are just as well known as like the turtles or you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, the Turtles or 
I don't know, like Mortal Kombat or something like that. Like people know who the Power Rangers are now. Whether they think they're cheesy or not is another thing. But in this fighting game, you find a way to kind of like make them very cool, especially with their various weapons and their like attacks, especially with the Me Megazord attacks like that, which are hard for me to deal with, especially when when you're talking about the Zords and bringing in assists and stuff. It can be it can be interesting in how much is on the screen as far as visual information but um i do truly dig how versatile this is and even though this game is it's weird it's simple in a way but when you put all this stuff together it can get it can get technical sort of is because it, it this fight, this this game doesn't work how a lot of fighting games work. There's this, there's this weird break and pause. And as you can see, you know, I was doing pretty well, and dude just gave up. So on to the next match, right? You know what I'm saying? Like, I I got it. I got matched up with a lot of people that just kept quitting on me. And I'm. It's not like I'm some amazing fighter. Like, don't you know? Don't get me twisted at all. Um, like abandoned saying this guy that i'm fighting right now or a woman that i'm fighting right now like yo was whooping me up something heavy you know what i'm saying like it, it was it was not a good look like you can see right here the the fights is getting you know pretty one-sided when it's dealing with abandoned saying but one thing i do like about fighting in this in this game with abandoned saying is I guess you have to, they, they force you to get outside of your comfort zone, uh, which is something that I like. Um, so on to the fight mechanics, which I don't know how I feel about them yet. All right, so it's kind of like a four button game. I guess you could say six button game. To, I mean, it uses all the buttons, but your main commands are out of the four buttons. You know, if you're using Xbox or, you know, PlayStation, it's basically on those four buttons. You can kind of get every, just about everything done there. You do um, use your tags on the bumpers, but for the most, you know, most attacks, and due to how, uh, due to how assists run, even though this is a team game, in a lot of ways it ends up being sort of a one-on-one -on -one game for a lot of the time. Um, but uh, to go forward, there's this when you when you make your attacks there's always like this weird pause after everything like say say if i do a say if i do a all right you saw how he did that particular combo like i right, want like help one all right see how there's like this weird pause between both of us it's like i guess it's just the opening pause to give someone a, a see like how there's like this weird and i mean unless you play it you know, unless you play it, it's hard to ex to describe. But like, say if you go into attack, there's the recovery time is weird in this, um, and I guess it's because I'm so used to Street Fighter. But the recovery time is weird, and also how they handle hitboxes is very different as far as like jump attacks. Um, the jumps are weird because of how long you hang in the air. Um, it's, it's almost like when you when you jump, it's like you're weightless for a second, but um, but it's it's just take taking some getting used to. Um, in general, it is a fun game to play. I've I've had a fun time playing it. Um, but yeah, the fight mechanics are weird. Where that weird pause after you perform a combo, like if someone's blocking you, so you come in with like a three four hit combo, right, and they're blocking you. After that last hit that they've blocked, it's like you pause. It's weird. It's like it's not a recovery time. It's like a. It's it's almost like a. It's almost like time that they placed in there for someone to kind of get you back. And and it's weird. Um, it's like it's like they. I don't know why they placed it in there like that. And I, I don't know. Maybe it's maybe it's to make the game a little harder or to make you know to make someone pay for trying to punish someone who's like blocking or something i don't know i, I really don't know but it is it is something that you should look out for because it's weird and it's strange if you're coming from something like um 
Dragon Ball Fighters or uh, uh, Street Fighter Four. I mean, Street Fighter Five. It, you know, it is it is definitely something weird. And um, one thing uh, one thing I've also noticed is like you can get caught slipping really easily when you think that you're pressing back for block and somehow it just doesn't work. But you do get this kind of reflect move with uh, block and um, block in A. A if you're on Xbox, if you're on PS4, I think it's like X or whatever, whatever the bottom button is. But um, like you do get a reflect, but it it's just we it just works in a different way, uh, and not in a different way where it's like oh this is cool, in a different way where it's like very noticeable and out of place. Um, so anyway, this guy is tearing a brother up, <laughs> as you can see. Um, it's it's not pretty, you know what I'm saying? It's not pretty in these streets, but um, just trying to find ways to uh, get in here and like make a difference um, and as you can see whiffing and like you know paying paying the price for whiffs um, but you know I like Daishi uh, and I like um, kind of like RJ the way he plays um, the only thing is that my team doesn't really have a whole lot of you know like projectiles but you know whatever so back to back to something that I thought was cool about this game is that when you start fighting, you don't get any idea of you don't get any idea of like how they rank or ranking in general, which is I guess is kind of cool to kind of keep you guessing like where you stand. But then a thing that I don't like in in these matches is one thing I don't like in these matches is like the matchmaking process is just like it seems to be kind of a crapshoot like even more so than even more so than uh, Street Fighter uh, it's like you don't know what's going to happen you're just sitting there waiting and waiting and waiting and like in Street Fighter 5 you know how you can like you know set the um well if you don't know in street fighter 5 you can be like hey search for matches but while you're waiting for a match you can do something else like you can be in training mode or something like that just kind of working out the buttons and everything here when you search for a match you're basically just stuck there there's nothing that you can do you're just waiting and it's it's you know it's annoying just sitting there waiting sometimes two, three, five minutes before a match comes up. Because for me, I was playing late at night and you end up just getting matched up with the same people over and over. It just ends up being a rematch, which is another thing I want to get to. You don't get an option to rematch someone in this game. You have to just go back to, I guess, sort of like the lobby. And it's frustrating because sometimes you want to rematch. Sometimes you just want to bail. I understand that. You know, sometimes you just want to bail. But the, you know, th this idea, you know, this, this idea that you can't like ask for a rematch, you know, you just have to go straight back to the lobby is weird to me. Um, just small stuff like that, that I'm like, you know, kind of like makes it stand out in a bad way where it's like certain options that you don't get from a game like, you know, it's Power Rangers. You think that there would be like more, you know, I guess you could say more thought into kind of like the online play since you know online play is is a large proponent of like any fighting game these days um as far as laggy matches i didn't have any that not that i can think of that not that any that any that stood out so i mean i'm guessing the net code is pretty okay um, but I mean, I haven't played it enough to know, just like last night I had like none, so everything was all good. Um, so I will say, you know, I didn't enjoy, I didn't experience that because I know, you know, it seems like I'm kind of ragging on the game, so I did want to give it some love, but you know, it's just that coming over from, uh, I guess you could consider a triple A title to something that I think should be a triple A title because Power Rangers has been around forever and like it's pretty well known at least at least in the geek space so I'm like there's a lot of things missing and I'm like where is this at um 
Now, I haven't played the, I played the story mode for like two seconds, but it was boring to me. I, but of course, it's one of the achievements, so I'm gonna go through it. You know what I'm saying? It'll help me get better, most likely anyway. So I'll definitely play it, similar to how I'm playing with um, Dragon Ball. But one major thing here is just the, the continuous reading and stuff in the story mode where I was like, really, dude? Like, come on, man. Y'all couldn't get them voices in there? That? Come on, man. And not to say that we don't have the voices, like, in the game, like, you know, like, you can hear Daishi's voice or whatever when he's fighting. But, like, in the story mode, it's like, like, that's, that's, who, that's what we got? Really? You know what I'm saying? It's like... Just a whole bunch of reading, like what year is it? Like that's that's what's popping, and not not words to the point where it's just like, oh, these are captions. In, c in case you didn't catch it. Oh man, that's an ill punish. Like who is this abandoned saying? No, this is uh, yeah yeah abandoned saying again, man. Abandoned saying is a beast. Like I like homie is tearing me to shreds. Yes yes, that's a little bit better. So. Um, it's just small things like that, like, uh, if I'm searching for a match, I would like to be able to, like, go about my business while it searches in the background for me. Um, I would like way more, way more outfits, like, you get, like, a couple color choices and that's it. Like, this is, it's a very, like, simple, almost cheap to where I'm like, yo, this is Power Rangers, though. Like, even someone who doesn't watch Power Rangers... I respect the legacy of like, yo, Power Rangers has been out for years and years, sold a, a kabillion toys or whatever, and like, you know what I'm saying, had like, what, like five, five, six different versions? Like, I know there's, I know there's like the, uh, one, two, three, there's at least five that I can think of, and I'm pretty sure there's way more, like they, you know, like even with the, I'm sure that there, no, there's at least 10 because they did that special where all 10 Red Rangers came together. So there's at least 10. So in that case, you know, I just feel like there's small bells and whistles like to the fight, like the recovery time. And it's not just a certain player's recovery. It's just the general recovery where if you're blocking, you're just there's like this weird pause they put on your character. So they can make sure that you know you're able to get them back or something, and it's it's weird. Um, the grab the grab distance is weird sometimes, but I mean that's any game. Um, but as far as back to what I was saying, as far as like, is it fun? Yeah, I've had a fun time playing this, man. Some you know what I'm saying it's kind of nostalgic, even though the the Power Rangers for me was the original series um uh the original series and um was it like ninja force or whatever whatever the the original series and the very beginning of the second series is like my era and after that i stopped watching it but it is fun seeing these characters hearing the voices uh the music is very power rangers-esque which it should be it's just that i'm not digging it really like the you know the kind of like metal style but once again it's very is is you know it's very reminiscent of that power rangers um oh one thing i would like to say when it comes to the megazord stuff them kind of like crossing you up with the zords and everything it's something that i think is cool i haven't been able to really you know i haven't been able to really capitalize on that because i'm not sure exactly how to properly use my megazord to my advantage I can use them, and I mean, of course, you've seen me use them. I use the samurai one, but I don't know if I've I've used it in a very, you know, in a very, uh, you know, I guess you could say, proper way. Um, as you can see, Abandoned Saiyan is taking me apart again. Like, homie is just, like, crushing me, man. It's, I should have stayed with Daishi on this one. Um, but yeah, Abandon Saiyan, I love fighting against Abandon Saiyan. He is a tough opponent, keeps me on my toes. I don't know who this man or woman is, but they are killing the game. Like, I, like that, that whole, you know what I'm saying? And essentially using a character that I use better than me. You know what I'm saying? And I, me, he's just ripping RJ to shreds. 
I can't even get RJ up out of this joint. He probably gonna send him to bed. Yep. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, I did catch him with the super, so that's word. I word word word. So um, uh, what's next up? Next up, um, oh, the levels. I think we definitely need more levels. I know this is in its um, was it season three? So I'm like, I'm looking at this game and I'm like, yo, three seasons in, like, yo, like, I want to see a little more. And I, and I copped all three seasons. So, you know what I'm saying? I have, I have all the characters available, but I'm just like, from a, you know, from a character, from a character standpoint, I think they're good. They got a good amount of characters. Um, and I'm sure, you know, they're adding more. There's still one more on the way, but as far as the levels, I'd like some more levels um you know as soon as possible because once again this just seems like something that should be up there this is a game that at least in name recognition wise i feel should be up there with like uh street fighter dragon ball mortal kombat um smash something like that because just the recognition and then when you play it you're like uh, this doesn't really have everything that I thought it would or thought it or think it should you know what I'm saying um is it still competitive yes this joint is kind of hard to play at times as you can see abandoned saying is taking me down so it's weird is it a simple game like open mindset yes I, I, I simple as in I'd say it's simple as in its looks and its general attacks but then, I don't know, then I'd say that due to its simplicity, since the, since the learning curve is kind of, since the learning curve is kind of short, it can get complex fast when you, when you get into timing your, when you get into timing your like kind of like your assist and stuff like that. Um, when dealing with people that are trying to full screen you like this, um, you know, as you can see, I kind of like dealt with this in a very interesting way. I think I end up taking her, taking her down finally, but it's not easy. You know what I'm saying? It's, you know, it's, oh, also I will say one thing that I love about this game that I think every game should have you get air block. You know what I'm saying? I love air block. It, it's it's a lifesaver. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, uh, she See how whoever this character is is trying hard to full screen me. Uh, finally gets me down. Because um, that's the only thing. Like None of my characters have any projectiles. So, you know, it's, you know, I'm definitely, you know, at a loss when it comes to, you know, when it comes to like that full screen game, but then, you know, you know, rappers are in danger right here, you know what I'm saying? And she's down. Um, they got Mastodon, uh, take that joint out. Um, I gotta make sure I stay as close as possible because I don't want that dumb stuff. Nice. And so, uh, back to the, back to the assist. Um, the assist are cool, I enjoy the assist. Now I just have to figure out how to properly, you know, how to properly like time the assist, how and when to deal with like, you know, the Zords, stuff like that, and how to utilize my characters fully. Something that I'm sure my my uh, my sensei open mind will put me up up on. Um, the only thing about dropping your Zord first is, you know, you always kind of wonder when they're gonna drop their Zord out. And word up, got it. Finally, down to the last. Because these these games, as far as like the way the it's weird. The game can be fast paced, but that small pause after your combos kind of make things weird. Um, so 
just trying to figure out cool ways to engage in this game and a you know it is it's a different kind of it's a different kind of feel than the other games that I play. So all in all, I say I, I'm having pretty uh, I'm having a good amount of fun with this game. I, I do. It's a it's a great it's a great change of pace from you know something like uh, something like um, uh, Street Fighter and. You know, I, I think I, I think I might stick with this. I think I might stick with this joint. I, I think I might stick with this and do something really cool. You know, figure figure out cool ways to and definitely like full screen that guy. Mmm, that was nice. That was nice. So anyway, let's get into the actual matches now. You know what I'm saying? We 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 kind of we kind of got through the review. So let's get into these matches. Um. Uh, cool got what is his name Dracon or whatever chilling with RJ I do like the background here where you see the Zords fighting that's cool um I don't know if it's randomized or not nice I look I just like RJ's look I wish he had more colorways man this that's one one big L this game takes is the colorways like there's only like two colorways for like each character man like what is what is really going on right now um and changing colors is not super hard. So, all right, cool. He's out. Goldar, what you want? Uh, come on, Daishi. Get. All right, cool. He left open. I didn't. I'm. A, I'm. A, I've been trying to learn how to chain these joints because uh, abandoned Saiyan be chaining the heck out of me, man. Abandoned Saiyan be having like 12 hit combos on him, brother. And the most I can pull out is like six hits or something. Oh boy, that that assist really hurt me. All right, cool. That's right. Don't don't sleep on the sweet. Footsies will get you, boy. No footsies will get you. Mmm. That's right. That's right. That's right. Uh. Oh, oh, oh what you know, my pet? Oh, That's right. Uh. Get up out of here. Ain't nobody trying to hear that. Oh snap! Oh, okay, okay, okay. I ain't got a little. You know what I'm saying? Got a little embarrassed, but it's all good. We we back, we back. Um. Oh, shouts out to speaking speaking of, uh, get embarrassed. Somebody's gonna get embarrassed tonight. I just remembered Saturday. So Saturday, you got Saturday Night Nightmares on Twitch. On um, I cannot remember his name, but search up on Twitter Saturday Night Nightmares, and you'll find the tweets for Twitch. I'll be tweeting about it tonight. Um, so you guys can see it. it's, it's a lot of fun. They get started around, I think six or seven. Uh, I should have just jumped over that because the chip damage in this game is serious. Like, like, you know how in Street Fighter, like you can like block and you'll have like a millisecond of, or, or a milliliter of, of health. This joint, the chip is real in this game. Hmm. Get up out of that corner, dude. What are you doing? Come on, man. Like, what are you doing? See, see what I'm saying? Falling for the BS that I tried to catch it with a super, missed it. Uh, come on, man. You there we go. Dude, connect on something in Jesus' name. Let's do something. I don't even know who I'm fighting against you. again. I thought it was, I forgot for a second, I thought it was abandoned saying, but I was like, nah. Look at this. Look, like, look at the. Mm. Look at that. Mm. Nice. That was nice. Uh, mm. Come on, RJ. Show him, show him what you got, RJ. Show Ain't nobody thinking about that. I need to jump. I need to jump on those from now on. And I and I got a move that can kind of deal with that too. So I need I need to deal with those from now on. I forgot. I forgot about that little second they give you in the jump too. So I need to I need to start respecting that a little bit more. Can I? There we go. Nice, nice little hit. There we go. Okay, coming with a little bit of power. Green Ranger ain't got me out yet. You know, we ain't gonna fall down. We ain't gonna We ain't gonna we ain't gonna take them hits no more. Alright, Daishi. You know what to do, Daishi. You know what to do. 
Killing me. And he did that swap strike because he wants me out of here. Bruh. Uh, I don't like this. Come come on, Daishi. I'm saying Daishi like it ain't me controlling the joint though. <laughs> Alright, so right here, trying to work, trying to work out the work out the you know work out the the attack i do get a good a very good assist on that one um but of course i get taken out this is me by myself i just got rj nice but i'm i'm holding strong though i'm not i'm not you know oh boy here he come playing flutes mm. Not looking good for your boy. I might be able to run timeout, but it's it's kind of it's kind of over for your boy. No, well, not really. I still got enough. Oh, I, ooh, straight with that. Mm, 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 mm. Oh. <laughs> so I still lost on the time expire, and. I think it's the same same match. Well, or not same match, but uh, pretty much running back because when I was playing last night, essentially it seemed like there was only like four of us, you know, on the online playing at all. Ugh. See how? That's weird. I gotta. That's. See, I'm, I'm killing. All right, and that's another thing. Figuring out the miss, the mismatches, like, cause Zordon is apparently a mismatch. For my boy, the Shadow Ranger, right here, and so apparently, like this is this is the joint that I need right now. Yeah. Uh, embarrassment. There we go. Just a little bit better. Nice counter into the super. Ha <laughs> ha. That's what I'm talking about. RJ gotta go down. Sorry, RJ. You got. I can't. Can't take no shorts. Nope. Oh. All right. Respect RJ. Respect RJ if you can. How is he? How is he getting me on my on that last hit though? I guess maybe that hit breaks breaks blocks. I guess. Yeah, cause that. Hmm. Yo, man, that that last hit, that last hit is serious right now. All right, my guy, let's roll, let's roll. Oh, uh, bringing out the Zord now. Can I get some hits in? Ah, uh, yo, that Zord is serious, man. Dealing with that Zord. Yes. All right. Even though it's over for me, basically, but you still got you still got to hold on, man. You still got to give that showing. And my super is full, but I ain't even like got a chance to show my super. Mm. See if I can suck him into that. Nope. Oh, I actually, oh, I actually did. I should have, I should have shot for another super, but. Yo, man, there it is. That's that's the game. That's the game. <laughs> Unfortunately, but yeah, as you can see, man, first first time in ranked. You know what I'm saying? Having a good time. You know, up in the up in the pit. I don't know. I'm. Um... Oh yeah, Zo Poetic. Yeah, yeah. I forgot about these matches. Yeah, Zopoetic is another is another good matchup I had. So, uh, and see that's that's another that's another like you know matchup that he does well in is like that RJ versus 
Except right there. That that actually comes through pretty well. Um, oh, speaking of that, I do like the uh, I do like the sparks flying. <laughs> you know, it's just reminiscent of you know the show where like put sparks on everything. Um, but as you can see, Zod Zod, you know, Zod gave me some problems. Giving RJ some problems too. Come on, man. Let me, let's show this. Look, do it. Good God, this is this is the problem with like mistiming those. Like you don't want to get you you don't want to get happy birthday, man. Like you do not want to get happy birthday. That's the tough joint. Is like messing around, getting happy birthday. Oh, I caught him beautifully up in that one though. Yep, and you gone. So this is this now it's two up. Mm. Yeah. So he caught me on that one fairly. Mm. Yeah, I gotta. Mm. Nice. All right, cool with the footsies. That that overhead joint is just serious, man. Like for real, that that overhead joint is serious. It's not even funny out in these streets. The way, man, that elbow from RJ is the business. Like shout shout out to RJ, man. RJ RJ be coming through. Unfortunately, he be whooping my butt, but you know what I'm saying. Whoo, boy, oh boy, oh boy. Come on, Daishi. Give, give it to him. Yo, that. Yo, thank God his sword is done. Cause uh, let's 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 get in and let's get let's get let's get some supers off. Let's try to get some supers off over here. And Mmm, nice. Nice swipe. I don't know why I'm not jumping over these. Should have went for another super. Or, excuse me, I didn't have another super at the time. And I'm out. Whoo, boy. See, this, this joint can get pretty intense. Um, in a, in a fun way. In a fun way. You know what I'm saying? Not intense in a way where you don't want to play it, but just like in a fun way where it's like, dang, there's so much going on, on the screen. And, you know, it's so much that you're dealing with. It's like crazy. But uh, getting that getting that proper timing. <laughs> Happy birthday and a couple of people on the assist. Yeah, nice little, nice little happy birthday, if you will. Mmm, her whooping me up. Woo! Yeah, yeah, there we go, there we go. Dang. That Zord, man. Figure, figuring out the right time to bring that Zord in. Because all you can do is just block and pray. You know what I'm saying? That's all you can do is like block and pray at a certain period. Yeah. You know, it's block, pray, and you know what I'm saying? Be like, I don't want to get hit. <laughs> I don't want the Zord to hit me like that. Do I catch her with this? Oh, yes, sir. There she goes. She out. I think I might take this match, y'all. I think I think I won this one, maybe. Because it's still, you know, it's any man's game right now. They got they got their ultra. I still got mine. Uh. Yeah, I'm trying to trying to figure out the right time to drop that Megazord in. Yeah, it. I'm trying to figure out the best the best way. Yeah, best way to bring in that Megazord, and that's it, y'all. 
So, NERD, SOUL, I had a lot of fun playing these matches. Holla at y'all later. Peace.